Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Victoria to A Heart of Darkness as South Africa where we are having some problems. We were on the losing side in a great war and that means that we have no standing military or navy to so to speak of. Which is quite a problem. We do we were also declared on by Egypt in a liberation war and luckily the United States backed us up but I'm not sure what they're going to do if anything they don't seem to be moving any troops do they have any fleets? they should have fleets right? they're the United States they have 16 whole boats, which is not a lot. Where are their 16 boats? They're over here. Oh, they might be doing something. I don't know. Well, anyway. At the moment, we'll be just... Uh, focusing on clearing up our nationalist rebels everywhere. Hoping that we don't lose too much before the end of this game. Luckily it doesn't seem that Egypt has moved any troops into a uh, position. Oh now they have. Let's see what the United States is doing. Oh, they moved their boats through the Panama Canal? No. Where did the fleet go? Oh, they are moving the fleet to the Mediterranean. So, presumably... They'll either be landing in Egypt or doing some kind of blockading. I don't know. They figure it out. It's not really my problem at the moment. My problem is trying to fight nationalist rebels with miners, worksmen and farmers. They don't actually have that many uh, troops here. I could go and fight them with my... Uh, <laughs> with my... Uh, Regiments of shitty, shitty infantry. Let's first clear up these rebels and we'll uh, see where we stand. Somehow this has become quite a big war. Italy has become fascist. How do they have a military? They got cut down to size and they still have capital ships. Cut down to size, I mean... Uh... Oh, wait. It just ended. Okay. Interesting. We can build our uh, ships again. Let's just uh, build them en masse. Do we have some more level 6 naval bases anywhere? No. Okay, let's start with these then. Let's also... Build army, let's see. No. I need most of them to be built somewhere in mainland South Africa.
Monzo fall no 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 I wish I could sort on uh wait I can just build them from the map that's right Can build them like this. Can build a Portuguese artillery, interesting. How many artillery am I building now? Seven. I need three more artillery to start off with. One more artillery. And like four airplanes. Build one airplane over here. Let's start with that, shall we? We're building 19 ships, we should be able to build more of them. Oh, we can build them here. No, we can't, it's a level 5 naval base. Well then, let's build more in the existing ones. Build at least 21. Twenty-two. We're building now. Okay, that's a good start. Now, where is our fleet? Over here, fighting the rebels. Anything building? I'm not so sure. Here we go. Uh, yeah, sure. Try it anyway. Get you back to the boat. Okay, so they are actually buying a uh, up supplies to be able to build dreadnoughts and units but it's not going that fast i hope that we can use the last three years to rebuild our shattered army and maybe reclaim our rightful great power status Apparently it was only a uh, disarmament for a few years, like two or something. I thought it was for like five. I guess I was wrong. Let's see, what did the... Uh, United States is just blockading or something. I don't know. Egypt is in the sphere of Germany. But Germany didn't uh, enter the war. You with your men go and hang out over here and as soon as the first dreadnought is finished I'll use it to sink the Egyptian fleet and smash their armies up. Seems that the first ones are rolling in. Only 40 days till we get some uh, of them going. So artillery though.
I have a huge cash reserve, so... It's just that the world supply isn't uh, bigger. Now go over here, why are you standing over there? Can we call you into our war? We are not the leader of this war. Great. Okay, so there is our first regiment of our new army. It's artillery. And more regiments are finishing. I'm not really going to use them in this war though. It's all just artillery that's finishing. I'm just waiting for this dreadnought to finish in 14 days. Hopefully it will be enough time to actually no you go here I want to sink their transport so they can't walk any uh... or I mean that they can't uh, go anywhere that I don't want them to go I want to have naval superiority There we go. We are a secondary power, but we are of a number 8 in the world for some reason. I guess uh, things have become pretty fucked up, but uh, Italy is still in a war. Which uh, over Serbia, so they can't not be a great power. So now that we have our dreadnought, we're first going to fund our navy with our infinite money. Then we're going to sink that fleet over there, and there we go. Land our troops in Asap. I thought they were already communist. Weird. Didn't go and attack them. They don't have gas. Well, that was a slaughter. You should have brought gas, mate. There we go, let's go and take our course back, you can chill over here. Some kind of army is forming anyway. Hey, the crisis erupted in Aquitaine, which means that our flashpoint tension will go down everywhere. It's great. Hey, the UK got a democrom oh, democratic uh, intervention. Great. It's also great that the United States is doing fuck all as normally.
go over there. What is the Egyptian capital? It is Giza over here. Can we get military access with the Ottomans? Yes. So our flashpoint tension should be very low now, yeah, it all gone down to uh, zero, It's great. Because there is a great war going, great powers are at war, they are fighting over Aquatain. Right? No, not anymore, the crisis got restored. Also, oh they're communists as well. January next year we should become a great power again. We have more points than Italy. I think, yeah, but only just. We will be getting a lot more uh, power points very soon though. We are remilitarizing as crazy. Azerbaijan exists. So they do. And <laughs> that's interesting. Also, friend didn't get Aquatame back. Yeah, we have a. Uh some military power from the fact that our reserves are mobilized. But we have 140 again from capital ships. Yeah, I'm not that worried. Uh, let's march you to Giza. Tunisian nationalists. Well, crap. Uh, let's deal with the Tunisian nationalists first, shall we? My army is still just not balanced. Uh, but. If I get military access in Spain, I can just walk them there. So even though it's mm, way too much artillery, I'm going to use you anyway. Wait, we have boats. Why am I not using the boat? I should be using the boat. It's way faster. We are winning the war. It's just very weird that... Oh, we finished researching every tech in the game before the end. That's good. It's just weird that at the moment we're just very focused on keeping everything together. Instead of... Uh, Expanding like we did for the entirety of the game. There we go. Go in the boat. Go here. And just invade Egypt from there. Those are professional soldiers as well. They should be way better. Can we start recruiting some more people?
Okay, I'm not like building strict compositions army armies at the moment, but I'm just uh, building wherever I can in the mainland. And then when these wars are done, I'll also start recruiting on uh, distant shores. So where is my army? No, I mean the other one. They're almost there. Yes, let's get these troops and let's... I guess I'll have to land them over here. They're landing. Oh crap. There was also an Egyptian army there. Can I ex There were a lot of Egyptians there. Ah oh, crap, I'm going to get them all killed. I should have just... Uh, well, not done that. I won. Oh, that's against... Uh, Ah, come on. The freaking... Uh... Oh, but this is actually a normal army. I'm going to win this because our composition is way better. And... Oh, the Americans landed as well. Wait. Yeah, but the army I have here is also a good army. It's not a crap army. Wait, huh? Where did all these troops come from? This is so freaking annoying. I can't see anything. The Americans over here will be reinforcing though, if they're not total assholes. Why aren't the Americans helping me? I won though. It was a very costly victory. For some reason I'm attacking them again. Oh, but that's fine. Great, so... We have minus 36, but I'm not the war leader. The war is not going well enough. We're winning massively. You, you're all the, the peasant uh, infantry, let's demobilize our forces. Wireless. Okay, well, I guess we managed to turn this around. Even though it cost us quite a bit of men, it's uh, actually one regiment of guards entirely. But I think we actually may have hold out against Egypt and we got enough points to be considered a great power again next year, I think. Why are we not? There isn't any war going on, we should become a great power. It's weird that we aren't. Well anyway, thank you all for watching, I'll see you all next episode.
बाय बाय